Bait and switch, sleight of hand, smoke and mirrors, all deceptions that make one thing seem like another. Like Amendment 4, an abortion amendment that's much more extreme than at first it seems. Here's Amendment 4, and here are other amendments from years past. Most provide detailed definitions of essential words, so voters know what they're voting on. So how many definitions does Amendment 4 provide? Zero. This small trick is a big scam. Amendment 4 says no law shall restrict abortion before viability, but never defines viability. It allows late-term abortions for a patient's health, but never defines patient's health. It allows so-called healthcare providers, not doctors, to define these terms, but never defines healthcare provider, a term broad enough to include non-medical staff at abortion clinics. Just as bad, Amendment 4 eliminates Florida's parental consent laws, replacing consent with notification and making abortion the only medical procedure a minor could undergo without a parent's consent. They didn't have to write Amendment 4 this way, but they did. Why? Because they want to deceive you, to make their extreme amendment seem reasonable. This is what Amendment 4's ballot summary says, but this is what it means. No law shall prohibit any abortion at any time for any reason determined by abortion clinic employees. This amendment makes abortion the only medical procedure your child can undergo without your consent. It sounds extreme because it is extreme. No definitions, no doctors, no parental consent. Amendment 4, way too extreme and not what it seems.